In this tutorial, we'll address how to cite web-based documents in APA format, including websites and web pages. Please note, all information mentioned is based on the sixth edition of the APA Style Guide. To properly cite these sources in APA, you must first understand the difference between a web page and a website. A web page is a file on the web which may provide text, pictures, or other types of data. A website is a collection of web pages provided by one person or organization and where all of the web pages share a common URL and are linked to each other. When citing an entire website, it is sufficient to give the address of the site in the text and leave it off of the reference list. This kind of citation is used when you are simply mentioning a website in passing. If you are quoting or paraphrasing information from individual pages on a website, rather than making reference to the website more generally, you need to follow the rules for citing each web page. To properly cite a web page, your reference section entry should follow this basic format. Authors are written as last name followed by initials. The author is followed by the publication date, which goes in brackets, followed by a period. Depending on the source, you may find the exact date of publication or just the year. Choose the exact date if it is provided. The title of the article is in sentence case, meaning only the first word and proper nouns in the title are capitalized. Note that the title of the web page should be italicized in the reference list if the work stands alone as one complete document, but not italicized if it is part of a greater whole. Follow the title with a format description in square brackets only if the format is something out of the ordinary, such as a blog post or lecture notes. Finally, include retrieved from and the URL. So, your completed reference entry might look like this. Please note that the author of a web page is often a group or agency rather than an individual. In that case, include the group or agency name in your citation. If there is no date listed, insert ND in the place where the date should go in the reference list entry and in the in-text citation. The copyright date on the website itself should not be used as the publication date for any web page on the site. If the web page does not have an author, substitute the title of the page for the author in the in-text citation and reference list entry. You will also need to cite the web page in the body of your text. An in-text citation for a web page must include the author and the year of publication. When quoting directly from a web page, you must include the paragraph number with the in-text citation. You can adapt these in-text citations to reflect any missing information, such as date of publication or no author listed. This concludes the website's video. Please check out our other video tutorials if you need more help.